barbecued chicken with a horseradish dip. Chicken with white barbecue sauce originated at Big Bob Gibson's in Decatur, Alabama. The Project Smoke version features a technique called smoke roasting and a special smoker called a drum smoker or upright barrel smoker. First step, fill the coal pan with charcoal briquettes. Then take about 40 briquettes out and place them in a chimney starter. To light the chimney starter, fill the bottom with crumpled newspaper. And to generate smoke, we're using one of the classic woods of the South, pecan chunks. You'll need three chunks on top of the coals. And just lower the coal basket into the upright barrel smoker. Now, once the coals are lit, dump the coals on top of the unlit coals. This technique is called top-down ignition. The fire actually burns from the top down, and that gives you a long, even burn. The next thing you want to do is cut the chicken in half. Using poultry shears, first cut down one side of the backbone, then the other side. On Project Smoke, we try and use organic chickens. Remember, what your chicken eats and how it's raised is as important as how you smoke it. So take out the backbone, remove any extra lumps of fat. Using a large knife, cut the bird in half. Take a hook and hook the chicken under the breast so it hangs like this. Insert metal bars in the smoker. That pecan smoke is great, but it's really strong. Then hang the chickens on the bars. And you might think that the bottoms of the chicken would burn because they're directly over the coals. But thanks to the thermodynamics of this cooker, it maintains an even temperature throughout. The cooking time is about an hour and a half to two hours. Meanwhile, let's make the dip. Start with mayonnaise, one half cup of grated horseradish, one half cup of cider vinegar, freshly grated lemon zest. This is the aromatic, oil-rich outer rind of the lemon. Sea salt, freshly ground pepper, and whisk the ingredients into a smooth dip. And we'll use this sauce both for glazing the chicken and as a barbecue sauce. Upright barrel smokers are great for long pieces of meat that you hang from the hooks, like whole beef tenderloins, half chickens. Uh, very fuel efficient. Uh, they hold in moisture. Uh, they're also relatively inexpensive. So if you want to get started in the smoking business without investing thousands of dollars, these are a great choice. It's been an hour and a half. Let's check the chickens. Oh, man, these are gorgeous. You want to cook the chicken to an internal temperature of at least 165 degrees. Insert your instant read meat thermometer into the thickest part of the meat. Bingo, we've got it. Now pull the chicken out and look at that. It has a beautiful mahogany color. And one of the advantages of smoking the chicken in an upright barrel smoker is that you work at a slightly higher temperature, so the skin actually gets crisp. The low and slow method is great for flavor, but it doesn't give you crisp skin. During the smoking process, I basted the chickens with melted butter. I'm just going to baste them one more time. This adds flavor and a beautiful sheen. And when the hooks are cool enough to handle, remove them from the chickens. Now, 
Now take about a quarter of your glaze and spoon it into a baking dish. And place the chickens in the sauce so they can absorb the dip. You want to let the chicken absorb the glaze for about 10 minutes. This makes it more tender and juicy. Any leftover glaze can double as a barbecue sauce. So let's see how we did. The chicken. We'll just cut it into pieces. Look at that, the knife just glides through the meat. It's so tender. The color is really beautiful. And it's a little different than the barbecue chicken with red barbecue sauce. This chicken is supernaturally tender. You can see the skin is still crisp. Just forgive me here. Mm. Take a slice of the breast and a little of the horseradish dip. Man, that is really nice. Great smoke flavor, super moist. What's really interesting is the barbecue sauce, that horseradish vinegar, the creaminess and the mayonnaise. It's very different than your usual barbecue chicken.